This is going to be a short video of several variations of what I call a simple stitch, straight stitch, <clears throat> could be a split stitch. Uh, if you'll notice that uh, the first two rows I've done, the stitch is coming up to the left of the previous row. And on the back side, um, <clears throat> it's coming up, I'm inserting it to the right of the previous row stitch. Okay, so to show you one stitch being taken, <clears throat> I'm going to come around, I'm going to insert, insert my needle about right here, and I'm going to come up on the left of the stitch below. <clears throat> okay. So if you'll notice, this particular pattern has a fairly straight stitch on the front, but the back comes out looking somewhat like uh, a brick pattern. Okay. A second variation, if you want the back to look exactly like the front, and this gets a little bit harder um, as the stitches get further apart. In fact, here's a good example of something I can do right here. Uh, the distance between these two stitches uh, is getting a little bit further than I like. So there are a number of ways to insert a stitch. The, the way I like to do it, which is the simplest, is just simply take uh, one extra wrap in the row. <clears throat> okay. You could also actually um, stitch through the row below, but that tends to break the pine needles, so I usually don't. Now, if you want the back to look just like the front, then what you would do is insert your, your needle on the left side of the stitch. It's probably a little hard to see, but on the left side, okay, and you come out on the right side. <clears throat> of the prior stitch. Okay. If you do this, and again I'm just going to take an extra wrap right here. If you do this, and again come in on the left, come out on the right, Then the back side, if you'll notice these two stitches right here, the back side is going to look just like the front. Okay. The last variation is simply what I call a split stitch. I'm having a little help from my kitty here. Go away, kitty. The split stitch is you're simply going to insert your pine your your needle in the middle of the stitch behind and come out in the middle of the stitch on the front and that creates what's called a split stitch. Okay, It's a little hard to do this over the top of the tripod and of course Marley's trying to help which doesn't make anything any easier. That is the simple the three simple variations of what I call a, a simple stitch or a running stitch. I'll try to do a V-stitch and another stitch in another video.